Our team coverage continues with the National News Desk's Kayla Gaskins, who's live at the Trump campaign headquarters in West Palm Beach, Florida. Kayla, good morning to you. You've been up for a very long time. You were there this morning when Trump declared victory. Good morning, Dan. Yeah, our coverage started yesterday uh, around noon and has continued. We did get a, a slight break in there to get a little nap in, but you can just feel the energy in the air here in West Palm Beach. You could feel it here at the convention center last night, and especially when Donald Trump took the stage at around 2.30 in the morning, which Jan was a lot earlier than a lot of people thought. He declared victory around that time, even though not everybody had projected that he had officially uh, become president-elect. At that point, he saw enough of the votes in that he declared himself this winner. And when we got up this morning, the general consensus was, yes, Donald Trump is, in fact, heading back to the White House. But just setting the scene at the convention center last night, there were thousands of people here, but it was a very select group. It was invite only. These were some of Donald Trump's most loyal supporters. You could feel the energy throughout the night steadily get more energetic as the momentum continued to trend in Donald Trump's favor, ultimately culminating with that big win of Pennsylvania when he knew, yes, he is in fact heading back to Washington. And during the speech last night, something that really stood out was when Donald Trump said to the to his supporters, you didn't just elect me, you elected the team, you elected the people that I've surrounded myself with, including his vice president, J.D. Vance. So making a really good point there that this wasn't just about him, this was about their their movement that he's created. Uh, so Jan, we'll see that in his cabinet selections in the coming days and weeks when he starts to announce those. All right, Kayla Gaskins is reporting live for us from West Palm Beach, Florida. Thank you.